We're here in Kansas City for this NFC West versus AFC West matchup between the Seahawks and the Chiefs. This is a game today that could come down to the two running backs, two of the real stars of the sport, two players who went in fantasy drafts really high. How do you see this one going down today? Yeah, and how's your fantasy team? Well, yeah, 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 yeah no, we won't talk that. about that. Let's talk about good things. But, you know, these, hey, these two teams are stars. You know why? Because we can see how the football team is built. And I think it is no doubt about it. The offensive line is a big part of it. They always have hope. If they block their guy a little bit, these running backs can make a big play out of it. They face first down. Lynch is on the toss, gets the football. He's got the touchdown. That's about as well as you can execute a drive by the offense, the opening drive. That even makes it better. How about that? The opening drive, you take it all the way down and score. The Seahawks now will tack on the extra point. The point after is good. The Chiefs are anxious to return the kickoff. About uh, 27 before he's taken down. The Chiefs at the line of scrimmage with their set of receivers in a bunch formation. First and 10. Throwing now to his left, and he's intercepted. I know this never happened in your decorated career, but an early interception, how will he rebound the quarterback? You know, I'll just say this, you're a funny guy. That's funny. <laughs> I, hey, I did it all the time, and I used to tell my offensive lineman, be ready, I'm probably going to throw some more, so make the tackle. The Seahawks lined up in the pistol. Russell Wilson will take it from the gun. Throws to the right. The tackle is made by Johnson. Zone defense doesn't work in the NFL like it used to. Good job by the quarterback reading that zone and finding the open guy. Lynch is lined up behind his quarterback as the single back. On second and three, here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. 
the tackle is made. It's often the difference maker in any game, and that is how you perform inside the red zone, and we're getting an early taste of that. No doubt about it, Jim. you got to be creative when you get in the red zone. We'll see what the offense calls. First down, following the long play. Back to the ground now on first down. They deck him in the backfield. So many things you could do on first down, and what do you come up? You come up with that play. That was just a bad play call. Percy Harvin with the grab. Nothing too exciting here, just plowing ahead getting closer to that goal line. Well, they're trying to find out if this defense has the courage and toughness to stand up to them. So far, they haven't. This deep runs it across. Touchdown. Oh, what a good job there by the offense. Third and goal. And what do they do? They run the football against the defense. And nice job getting the touchdown. The point after try is in the books. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. Here comes the training staff as we've got a player down on the field. Well, that looks like an upper body injury, Jim. I think we both can tell that. And uh, now the question is, how bad is it? Uh, you just never know. Jamal Charles is in the backfield. First and 10. Charles is going to take the handoff now. That's a terrible read by the running back. It's a short game, but it's all his fault. He picked the wrong hole. He should have cut it back. He didn't, and that's why he was tackled. And they'll run the football with Charles. He gets past the first wave. What a good job by the defensive player there. Just flushing the running back and driving him into the ground. Charles is lined up as the single back. Third down and three. Jamal Charles carries the football. Fights through that hit. Gains 11. What a job by the offensive line that time. This running back hit the hole at full speed, and the defense had very little time to react. And that's how he got in the secondary, made a couple guys miss, and gets down there and gets a long run. And he'll step out of bounds. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. Smith will take it right from the center. Second and seven. Here's the quick toss to the running back. Big gainer there by Jamal Charles. Good job that time by the running back getting down the field and picking up big yards. Let's see how they back up the big play here. Jamal Charles. Hey, up the middle. Anytime you get in the red zone, you want to punch it in there and get seven points. Uh, they're being dominated today. They're down more than seven, but don't worry about it. Score here and just keep playing. It's a second and four. They'll run with it again. Someone's been injured out there. Hold on a minute. Always hard to guess what the injury is, but and don't like to speculate, but I think it's pretty apparent. It's an upper body injury. We'll let you know when we find out. Third down. Get ready. Three, three, three. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. And Davis has got it on the handoff. That'll stop the play right there. Find a way to score. That's always the mantra with every team when they get in the red zone. If you punch it in here, even though you're down by more than seven, it'll give you confidence for the rest of the game. 
First and ten. Ball's going to be incomplete. The hit knocked the ball out. That was a big hit by the defender that time. The receiver drops the football. I'll tell you what, I guarantee the next time he goes over the middle, he'll be looking for that defender. Charles is a running back, but he's in the slot for this play. Second and ten. Ball is out. And he's brought to the ground. Nice job that time by the offense. Even though they fumbled it, at least they were quick enough and smart enough to get it on it right away. Marching down the field and taking their time. Third and 20. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations. The Seahawks defense now is going to go nickel. Wide to the left, picks up just a couple. Finally, the defense stood up. It's fourth down. They've given up a long drive, but they come through in the clutch that time. Nice job. Offense lines up here. First and ten. Trying to work that left side. And he was wide open. The Seahawks are in the end zone for the touchdown. you got to take advantage of situations like this. Not often in the NFL do you get somebody this wide open. Good job by the receiver. Nice job by the quarterback seeing him. And what do you get? An easy touchdown pass. Seahawks lined up in the nickel. Handoff to the back. Got a little crease. Boy, after watching that long run, I'm winded. That was a nice job by the running back. Good job up front, sustaining the blocks. Offense got to be happy with that. Offense lining up here after picking up more than 30 on the previous play. There's some shifting around in the backfield. Smith's going to take the snap from the shotgun. He's wide open for the grab. And that's going to do it for the first quarter. We'll be back from Kansas City for the start of the second after the break. The Chiefs with a huge gainer right before the break and now coming back to the line to start the second. After the long game, let's see what they do here. Now, makes the move to the right. In this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got some men up front. And that time, they stopped that run just for a short game. After the two-yard carry, it sets up second down and eight. They knock him down behind the line of scrimmage. Well, these plays do look ugly when they don't work. It's, it's second down, and you run the running play, hoping to pick up a few yards to make third down easier. But when you lose yards like this, Third long, three, tough to do. Three. The running back motion, goes motion, in motion. motion. Now it's a third and 13. Looking for an open receiver on the right. The tackle was made, but the first down is picked up. This is where games are won and lost. Once an offense gets down the red zone, even though they're down more than seven, can you find a way to punch it in there for the touchdown and not three, settle for a field goal? Smith's back at it now. Dropping. That's a touchdown, and that tightens things up. That's a good touchdown by the offense there. And, you know, what it's done, it's gotten this game closer. Gives them confidence, and confidence is a dangerous thing. We'll see if they can keep moving forward after this.
Lining up now for the two-point conversion. So they give up the touchdown, but they do not allow the two-point play. Yeah, good job that time by the defense. So quick and so ready for that play. They reacted very fast. That's why they stopped it. The Seahawks are set to return the kickoff. This kick will stay on the ground, avoiding a big return. And the tackle is made right around the... Two-yard line on the return. Lynch is lined up in a single back formation. First and ten. Lynch now cutting to the right side, looking for some open space. When you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards. You are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying, we're tougher than you are, and we're just going to come right at you. Second and four. He's in the clear. They get to him just in time. One yard shy of the first down. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Defense calls a timeout. <laughs> Harvin's going to get set in the slot for this snap. Wilson standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. And Harvin, with some nice hands, brings in the bullet pass. Touchdown, Seattle. Well, you got a lead. You drive down the field. You score a touchdown. Now we're going to find out if the other team can stay patient or will they panic. Inside of the uprights. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. Tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. First and 10. They come to the line, and it's first down. They've got him behind the line of scrimmage. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. Alex Smith from the gun, challenging the defenders to the right side. What a nice quarter route run by the wide receiver. He fakes the defensive back out, and look at the quarterback. He knows that little move. When he stuck it, he let him out to the corner. Nice throw, nice kick. He sends the halfback in motion. First and 10. Down the field. Incomplete. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against this cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right down the middle. Second down coming up. Looking across the middle. They've got him down there. The quarterbacks and receivers in this NFL now are so good. It's so easy for them to throw and catch and just keep picking up those first downs. Alex Smith will take it right from the center. Back to the air here on first down. Challenges the coverage and has the completion. 
When you talk about throwing the football into open space, that's almost always against zone defenses. That's what we saw that time. Good job by the quarterback throwing it in there. As they go ground here, that's a three-yard game. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home. They stay in their gap, and they hold that run to a short game. It's now second down and seven after the three-yard rush. And they'll give it to Jamal Charles. That brings the play to an end. Nice play call that time by the offensive coordinator coming with the counter run. And the defense being too aggressive, they're over-pursuing. So you do the little counter, go the opposite direction, and it works well. Catch is made by Dwayne Bowe. So anytime you're in the red zone, you want to punch it in and get that touchdown. If they do that, look, they still, they're still going to be behind, but it gives them confidence to move forward. First and goal, and they'll run the football with Charles. Two-minute warning. This team likes to throw the football in the end zone once they get inside the red zone. This is a nice changeup. They fool them. Well, they thought they were going to fool them with the run, but it only gets a short game. The defense comes out in the nickel. Second and goal from the seven. Looking to scramble. He steps out. They're just grinding away down here, inching closer to the end zone. Well, that's what you got to do sometimes. It's hard always to think that you're going to come out and just make big plays. You got to do the dirty work, and this offense is doing it right now. Mounting a serious drive. Jamal Charles carries the football. Big decision for the coach this time, Jim. You failed on third and go. What do you do? Do you go for it? I say you call the play and you try to put up seven points. Fourth and goal from here. The Chiefs turn the ball over on downs. This is really demoralizing. When you drive the football down the field, you're in a fourth down situation. You want to keep this drive going. Terrible play call by the coach. Stops the drive. Pistol formation. The formation here, shotgun. Could have been intercepted. That time the man the man coverage won. The quarterback had to make a perfect throw. He didn't. Incomplete pass. And Rice is in the slot. Wilson from the shotgun hauls it in for the first down. When you're backed up, there's just so few plays that you feel comfortable running. That time, nice job by the play caller. Gave the offense a chance, and they picked up a big first down. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Tackled at the 18. When you run off tackle, one of the things you're looking for is for your tackle to make a good block, and then if you have a lead fullback, can he get past him and block the linebacker to free up the halfback so he can go in between them and get in the secondary and make a big play. That's just a bad job by the quarterback that time. Bad decision. He keeps the football, doesn't pull the defense, and he gets taken to the ground and loses yards. Third and nine, the give. Taking it right up the middle, Eric Berry makes the tackle. Marshawn Lynch takes the football to the 25. I guess that's how we're going to be today, isn't it? Uh, we're just going to go for it on fourth down. That time they go for it, and they get it. Good job. And Rice is lined up now as a slot receiver. Now first and ten. Looks to his left. Makes the grab. And the tackle is made at the 41. 
Perfect defense call that time. They allow the catch. The coach on the sidelines going, well, what else do you want me to do? We had the guy double covered, and you still couldn't make the play. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Working that left side. Interception. He's brought down. All right, well, I have to say that's just a terrible decision by the quarterback there. He's got to know when you're in a situation like this, you just cannot make that type of pass. Let's go. One more stamp in halftime. Smith's back in shotgun formation on the run. Breaks free, has some space to work with, steps out of bounds. And that's going to do it for the second quarter. We'll be back to Kansas City for the start of the second half after the break. We're back here now in this one, where the Seahawks are leading by 22. Steven Hauschka ready for the kickoff. Smith's got it in the gun. Looking to the right side and throwing. Incomplete. Almost going in the other direction. There are a lot of ways to attack cover, too. You can go deep down the middle where neither the safeties are, or if a linebacker covers somebody deep down the middle, then throw it short underneath the defense. Failing to complete that one. So, second down here. Get ready. Halfback sent in motion. Alex Smith's going to take it from the shotgun. He wants to go deep. Almost intercepted. I think that's the hardest pass a defensive back has to defend. The long throws down the field. You have to wait to the last second to make your play. That time the defensive back did it. What a play. Charles is on the right side. Split out wide. Smith's going to take it from the gun. Alex Smith looking long. Falls incomplete. Fourth down coming up. Looks like we'll go three and out on this series. Jamal Charles is in the backfield. Trying to make something happen. Eyeing that left side. He's brought to a halt. Well, when your team is behind, what do you do? Just come out there and get a first down. That's a nice job by the offense. Charles is in the backfield. Single back set. That's a gain of eight. I guess nobody in the NFL knows about pain more than running backs. Even though he was hurt and injured early in the game, he comes back in and that time he created his own pain, broke a tackle, and picks up some yards. Second down and two. Throws to the right. And almost picked off. Well, the quarterback can't get him open. He threw to the right guy that time, but the coverage was so good by the defense, uh, nowhere to get the completion. Quarters formation here for the defense. Third and two. He'll fire it out to the left. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. When you see defenses playing man-to-man -man coverage, what they are seeing, we are going to force the quarterback to make an accurate throw. Well, that time, that was accurate. That's why they got the completion. First down, throwing again. Deep down the field to Bo. Almost intercepted that time. What a good job by the defensive back that time. That ball was thrown beautifully down the field. High arcing throw, but the defensive back in great position 
knocks it down. The defense comes out of the nickel. Second and ten. Alex Smith looking long. Ball's picked off. Tackles made. What a terrible job by the quarterback. Nobody's open. Tries to force the pass and look. What's it turn into? An interception. The Chiefs call timeout and they'll have two remaining. Lynch is lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. Russell Wilson will take it from the gun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. He's stacked up at that point. This play you see a lot in the NFL now. It's called a drag route. Going across the field. Good job by the receiver. Out from the defensive back and a good throw by the quarterback. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Lynch is taking the handoff. And they came up a yard short. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. Russell Wilson has it under center. Third and two. They hand it off to the running back. Running to the left side. McCoy is shifted from tight end to a receiver in the slot. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. The Seahawks now move the chains. Nice job by the coach that time going forward on fourth down. His team is up here in the second half. He wants to keep momentum on his side. That's why he goes for it, and they get it. First down and 10. Going to lose yards here. Well, the play is there to be made, but the offensive player doesn't get it done. Bad job on first down. Coming up, second down. Set up screen. He's going to be swallowed up behind the line. Well, that's the new NFL. Just keep throwing it behind the line of scrimmage and see if the athletes can catch it and make some yards. None there that time. A loss of a couple yards. Third and forever. Escaping the pressure. Goes deep to Sidney Rice. Able to get a step on the defender, and he makes the catch. Boy, they got a good drive going here, Jim. I guess you don't hear that too much on the golf course, do you? The way you hit it everywhere. But this offense, they're clicking. They're making plays. Let's see if they can take advantage of, of just moving this football down the field. First and ten. Lynch trying to find an opening to the right. In on the stop. Well, that was a nice run that time off tackle. And listen, this is a bread and butter play in the NFL. It's about power running. Can your offensive tackle make the block to free up that running back so he has a chance to get in that secondary and make a nice run out of it? Setting up in the pistol on this play. Second down and four. They tackle him for a loss. Got to get the defensive credit here, Jim Nance. Good job on the option play. They just attacked the offense. The quarterback kept the football, but there's nowhere to run, and he lost yards. Wilson's going to take the snap from the shotgun. The Seahawks get a first down. That's a nice job by the offense there. Get the first down. Keep those chains moving. Give yourself three more opportunities. This has been a long drive so far. First and ten. The quarterback will hand it off. Takes it the distance for the touchdown. Never be satisfied in the NFL. Players are just too good. So when you get a chance to score, even though you're leading, take advantage of it. Awesome job by the coordinator on those play calls.
The Seahawks now lined up for the extra point. Add the extra point, the kick is good. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. down as they head to the line. Ball's lofted out there, and Bo brings it in. When you talk about the play-action pass game, it's really when you call it. you got to be in a situation where the defense is thinking run, and when they are, do you have the courage, or I should say the smarts, to fake the run and throw the football. Good call that time by the offense. First and ten. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. And incomplete. This is frustrating for a coach. You call a play, you hit the receiver down the field on a quarter route, and your quarterback cannot put it on the target. Second down after the incompletion. Zeroed in on that one. Well, even though they're down more than seven here, the offense down the red zone, it'll be good for them for the rest of this game. Their confidence uh, for the offensive coach that they can punch this in for the touchdown. And that's going to do it for the third quarter. We'll be back from Kansas City for the start of the fourth after the break. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to pack it up. To the right. Power surge for six. Touchdown. I'd say this run by the offense is just, it's arrogance. They just say, you can't stop us. And they lined up and just shoved it down the defense's throat. Nice run there on first and goal for the touchdown. Well, this works out about 40% of the time if you look back on history. Got the touchdown, got the two-point conversion. People love to go for two in this game, don't they? Well, they do, and you know what? Now, I guess you and I just can't sit here and blast the coach for a bad decision. When you pick up the two points, you can't complain about what they're trying to do. Gets out past the 30 and brought down at the 35. Tight ends, first and ten. Gets away from the pressure. He's got the grab, and he's got the first. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. On first down, and now on first down, they'll go back to the air. And he's going to be brought down. Well, that's a good job by the defense that time, getting the sack on the blitz. And when you blitz, you're taking a chance. You better get to the quarterback, and that time they did. The throw to the left. Intercepted. The Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled, being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. He'll fire it out to the left. He'll be taken down about three yards short of the first. Nice catch by the receiver, but it still doesn't get a first down. Jamal Charles is in the backfield. Smith standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. Throwing now to his left. It's intercepted! Well, nowadays, your linebackers, they got to be able to do everything. they got to be big enough to get in there and stop the run. 
and also athletic enough to be able to get in position and make an interception. Good job by the linebacker. Lynch is lined up directly behind the quarterback here. And he'll go to the left. And he's going to be tackled right around the 31-yard line. The Seahawks line up in the pistol offense. Second and 11. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. The Seahawks will go with the pistol on this play. Swallowed up behind the line of scrimmage. That's just a bad job by the quarterback that time. Bad decision. He keeps the football, doesn't pull the defense, and he gets taken to the ground and loses yards. Trying to work that left side. That'll put them in what we call plus territory. Got to have a lot of courage to call these type of plays, don't you, Jim? And, and at that time, even though this team is winning, the coach decides to go for it on fourth down. Good play call, and they make it work. Let's all us out. The defense has the football. They pounce on him there. Well, that's what you call a takeaway. That time, the defense just hit the ball carrier so hard that he had to give the football up, and they lose it. Smith will take it right from the center. First and ten. Going across the middle. The Chiefs now move the chain. The quarterback that time realized it was zone coverage. He just waited for the defense to get out of position, and he threw it to the open hole. First down here after the completion. And the quarterback is taken down. Hard to get these hits against quarterbacks now, these blind side hits because everybody's worried about getting hit as a quarterback, the protections, all the smart things they do, getting rid of the football fast, but they couldn't stop at that time. Big hit. Had it for a moment, but the ball is knocked out incomplete. Well, they always say if you get your hands on the football, you got to make the catch. Yeah, right. The guy that made that rule up wasn't getting hit as he was trying to catch the football. Nice hit that time by the defender. Please. Now looking at third down. Deep down the field to Bo, unstoppable. The 10, no stopping him, taking it all the way home for the touchdown. What a terrible job by the defense. That time, nobody even covers the receiver. He is wide open down the field, and hey, nice job by the quarterback going through his progression. He finds the open guy and gets a touchdown pass. The kicking team now getting set here for what looks like an onside kick. The receiving team has the recovery. formation here's the handoff and they'll run it now slashing to the right side looking for room and that gets the first down well when you try to tackle this guy his legs are the size of a refrigerator so hard to wrap him up that's why he picked up the big game the Seahawks in the pistol first and ten leading on that running attack again here on first down that's a 30-yard game 
Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. Offense lining up here after picking up more than 30 on the previous play. Wasting no time. Here's the toss to the outside. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. And now they'll try over again on second down. Looks to his left. Seattle is in for the score. Touchdown. What a tough throw and catch into a tight spot right there for the touchdown. But today's game, these players are so good that you have to throw it in traffic. They've got to make the catch. That time he did. The Chiefs are anxious to return the kickoff. And they're all over him at the 18-yard line. Split backfield here. First and ten. Has the reception all alone. You know, when you throw the football like that down the field, you pick up the first down. Now you can do anything you want on the offensive side, and you got that defense guessing. That reception gave them the first down. Throws the pass. That pass incomplete. Offense lines up here. Second down and ten. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. It's always good when your quarterback is able to deceive the defense with good play action fakes. That's what did it that time. Look at the quarterback. Nice fake. Defense reacts to the run, and now you throw it over the top for the easy completion. Another name for the fly route, the go route. It's a streak. And that means they want you to be a blue streak, run as fast as you can, get by that defense, and make a big play. Here they are inside the 20, and they keep their hopes alive as they move down the field. Yeah, they've done that. Now they got to do the hard part. When you get to this, this part of the field in the red zone, we know the defense is not worried about deep throws down the field. You've got to hit those seams. We'll see if they can get it done. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Touchdown at the end. If you go to an NFL practice, they spend about 40% of their time practicing plays going in to score. That's why they made it look so easy here. Nice throw by the quarterback on first and goal. They'll get set looking to convert on this two-point try. Working that left side. Complete. Could have taken the one-point gimme. They went for the two, and they are turned away. Chiefs getting set for kickoff. They're not going to risk the big return, so here's the squib kick. And he's going to be taken down at about the 33, maybe the 34-yard line. Rice is lined up in the slot. First and ten. Getting sacked. Nice job that time by the defense getting the sack. The blitz was well-timed. When it's well-timed, the offense doesn't have time to react, and they get a good sack. Marshawn Lynch takes the football. The tackle's going to be made, but he's beyond the first down marker. Running backs who can pick up extra yards, they are so valuable. You can't always block everybody to the ground, 
the running back's got to do it himself sometimes. Nice job there by the running back. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Goes deep to Sidney Rice. Makes the kick. Touchdown, Seattle Seahawks. What a job by the offense. So little time left to drive down the field and score. That just ices the game. Nice job by the whole football team today, but especially on the offensive side. They're lining up here for the onside kick. like they've recovered the onside kick. The quarterback is coming to the line, hoping to avoid being sacked for a third time. First and ten. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. The Seahawks use another timeout here, and they have one left. And Rice is a receiver in the slot. We're gonna take off with it. Pass is made, but the hit knocks the ball out. Incomplete. Good timing by the defensive player that time. He gets to the receiver just as the football is getting there and makes the hit, knocks that football loose. Coming to the line at the 50. Setting up in the pistol on this play. They send the tight end in motion. Third down and five. Going off tackle here. And that's a big tackle behind the line of scrimmage. That's going to do it here in this one. Phil, before we go, how about a little chat about how much this win means? Well, you know, Jim, let's look at it this way. It was just a nice win. It, it keeps your confidence up, and it just gives you a little energy to, uh, to go out next week and try to accomplish it again.